across the region. You can see the sub zero temperatures off to our north and northeast. Look at Casper, Wyoming. Oh, wouldn't that be nice? 32 out there. It's in the teens and the 20s off to our south and southwest. We have a warm front lifting across the state, a little clipper system coming through. But with that warm front, some gusty winds. So it still feels like 11 below in the metro, feels like 13 below in Sioux Falls, 12 below in Des Moines, 25 below on the other side of Iowa this morning in Dubuque. Again, 5, minus 11, temperature and feels like. Clear skies, winds out of the southeast. Relatively light right now, 10 to 15 miles an hour. You can see the double-digit readings not that far away. It's 11 in Fremont and Beatrice. Still zero, though, in Harlan and Atlantic. So if you have any early morning errands that you need to run, make sure you bundle up. These wind chills are going to stay near or below zero this morning, especially in western Iowa. That's where it still could feel like 10 below zero, I would say, through about 9 o'clock. So one more chilly morning, but it does get better as we go into this afternoon. Yeah, along, that, uh, along that warm front, just a few clouds coming in right now. We'll see plenty of sun through the first half of today, but probably a few more clouds as we go into the afternoon, especially if you live north of the Omaha metro. I'm going to say north of the Platte River. Uh, you can see just a few more clouds across the Dakotas there. This is our clipper system that's zipping through. Not a lot of moisture with it, but it is going to bring our temperatures up and then right down, as clipper systems tend to do. So at 9 o'clock, as we start the hourly planner, mostly sunny. South wind starting to pick up, gusting to 25 miles an hour. It'll still feel like zero to five below. Up to 27 at noon, and that's when we see the strongest winds. Late in the morning into the early afternoon, they still they could be gusting as high as 35 miles an hour. Partly to mostly sunny, seasonal. We have not said that in a long time here. 33 degrees by three o'clock. Enjoy it. 30 degrees by six o'clock. Calmer winds, but still kind of cold out there as we go into the evening, and then we're down to 24 degrees at 9 tonight. So here's the big picture on Storm Predictor, that clipper zipping through today. You can see by noon that cold front still off to our north and west. Starts to get in later this evening. Not a lot of precipitation with this. It's just going to turn our winds around to the west and southwest, then kind of stall out, hang around here over the next day or two. And what we're going to see on Sunday is a little wave ripple right along that front. So as we go into Sunday evening, maybe a few light snow showers coming through here another, ahead of another push of cold air, and we are going to get chilly again early next week. We go from 34 today down to 25 tomorrow with some late day flurries, 16 on Monday, but it does get so much better. Look at that, 40 and sunny on Friday.